Hello and welcome back to more Storm 4, and I just remembered this game has cutscenes. I'm not kidding, I, I literally forgot the game had frickin' cutscenes. Um, yeah, game story mode has cutscenes, yeah. Sounds like something obvious. But regardless of that, yeah, this is just a normal fight. Um, I could probably speedrun the fight itself, I'm actually halfway decent at this. But enough stalling, let's get into some cutscenes. So something to mention is... The f because the game came out during, like, the like during the anime was, like, still ongoing. Like, the game had caught up to the anime. Uh, around, ha like, for the first half of the game, a lot of the cutscenes are the use still images from the anime because this video didn't have a high enough risk of getting copyright claimed, apparently. <laughs> video, the whole series suffers from it. Uh, the first mission is, like, the only thing... Like, over here where we fought Madara. This is the first... This is, like, the only thing in this entire half of the game that doesn't use anime stills for its solitary cutscene. Um, however, everything through to the second half... Everything through the first half of the game past that point does. I'll, I'll just show you all what I mean right now. Land of Fire, Hidden Leaf Village. There stood a boy whose clan had been eradicated by his own elder brother. A boy by the name of Sasuke Uchiha. He lived for a period of time in peace. But as soon as he began walking down the path of revenge, he slipped into darkness. And finally succeeded in conquering his brother, Itachi Uchiha. But his brother's words had all been lies. The Hidden Leaf was the real enemy. Soon, the tiny flames of hatred grew into the inferno that was the fourth great ninja war. And the events of the last game. And as the terrible conflict erupted, as he dashed toward the battlefield, Sasuke Uchiha saw someone completely unexpected. His brother had been revived into the physical world. Over time, the two came to terms with each other and were finally brothers once more. And then, after succeeding in what he came to do, Itachi disappeared into the light. I will always love you. Leaving just one line of truth with his little brother. There you are. See it, sir. And you go? We've been looking all over for you. So, what do you want with me? Why did you come all this way to find me? Uh, well, the thing is, we just happened upon a mind blowing scroll in Orochimaru's hideout. Take a look. Well, pretty amazing, huh? Yes. They're the ones with all the answers. There's someone I need to see now. Who's that? Orochimaru. Huh? Hmm? What are you talking about? You iced his ass. You know Orochimaru. You really think that'd be enough to vanquish him? Jugo, bring that woman too. Who is she? A hidden leaf ninja Kabuto kidnapped. The seal absorbed Orochimaru's chakra. We'll just use that to summon Orochimaru back. Whoa, hold on. Reviving Orochimaru is way too dangerous. Huh? Curse unsealing! Uh. Uh. 
<laughs> I forgot this section had in engine cutscenes. I completely forgot about that. I don't actually think about these two opening missions all that much. anything. Are you sure this is okay? I'm tearing us, Rank! Uh, kind of seems like you weren't going all out, Lord Orochimaru. Had enough? I've limbered up. Yes. That'll do for now. Fighting him made me realize that he's a bit different from before. So, there's something I want you to do for me, Orochimaru. Yes, you really don't need to explain all that. I've been watching him the whole time, remember? And when you meet them, then what? I know too little. I want them to tell me everything. You needn't trouble yourself with all that. You're still just a child after all. No. I'm not a child, not anymore. I can't be a child. I need to know how it all began. I need to know who I should be, what I should be doing. I want to know everything, so I can decide what it all means for myself. I want to make my own judgments, then I'll decide what needs to be done. I think I quite like you now. Very well. I'll help you. Come with me. Where to? <laughs> oh, to a place you know very well indeed. Come, let's go. So those were the anime still cutscenes, and they're all throughout the first half of this game. Like I said, the in-engine cutscene, like with full motion and everything, caught me off guard. I also can't believe I asked around this. Usually Orochimaru is terrible to fight. Oh yeah, by the way, because this is on a fresh account, I will be getting trophies. Uh, I left all my notifications on because there are some blocked scenes that you can't record with the PS4. Now, of course, I have a capture card. Capture cards don't give a shit about the security feature. Um, play those who know all which i believe is a flashback um but instead i'm gonna play naruto's half land of fire hidden leaf village here lives a boy who dreams of becoming the village leader the hokage that boy's name is Naruto Uzumaki. In his body dwelled the nine-tailed fox, the mighty-tailed beast that once attacked the village, but the strong will that he was born with allowed him to run down the path of growth. However, there was trouble 
brewing in the ninja world. An organization known as the Akatsuki had set out to collect the Nine-Tailed Beasts, including the Nine Tails, and declared war on the ninja world, releasing the flames of a massive conflict. Once they were ignited, the flames continued to burn on and on. But Naruto Uzumaki just kept staring straight ahead. Having forged new bonds, he kept his eyes fixed on the future and let loose a roar. That roar grew stronger and spread. And as if they were echoes, his many allies leapt into action. Naruto. All for his sake, as he keeps on fighting. This world is meaningless now. <gasps> the ghetto statue here? Don't tell me he's ready to begin. Now, time for chaos! The roars from the splitting earth herald the end. As this battle to save the ninja world enters its final stage. The ultimate death match begins. The world no longer needs hope, a future, or any famous heroes. When this reality ends, all that will remain is a single endless dream. I had a dad, a mom, an old man sage. Kids look up to heroes, so I'm gonna keep charging ahead without losing my way. I'm gonna become the best Hokage there's ever been! That's my dream, you idiot! So some things they don't explain. Um, Masked Man there, but it's so hard not calling him by his real name, wants to cast something called the Infinite Sukuyomi. Basically trap the, the entire planet in one endless dream. I don't think I need to explain to anybody why we can't let that happen. Do you really think it's going to be that? <laughs> That's a look of pain if I ever saw one! Right. <laughs> If you're really so much better than us, take that mask off and show us how calm you are, you loser! He really is strong. What should we do, Kakashi? <laughs> There's something that won't leave my mind. <laughs> what is it? I'm ready this to This is run. still just a hypothesis. This <laughs> is my common. What? And we're using the same jutsu. Then our eyes must be the same. Which means that the space time dimension that appears in the same If I can use that, Less damage! I'll take you all into a infinite dream before you know what hit you. We'll sleep when we feel like it. And when we do, we'll dream as much as we want. I don't need your help to fall asleep. If my hunch is correct, the one behind that mask. Whatever you've got up your sleeve, it doesn't scare you. All your power is Seriously. <laughs> What's lurking behind that mask? Could it be? Lightning blade! That's it. And that's how strong the are. I need to corner him. 
Then I'll definitely be able to find out who he really is. You saw how much health I had left. I kicked his ass. I connected with both of their ninjutsu and ended it with a linked secret technique. I know the final fight, the S rank requirement is literally win with over 95% of your health left. That's the only requirement, but Jesus, that is a tough requirement. I know the earlier fights were a lot more lenient, though. Kakashi. Tail face bomb. You're too late. He can face to attack by inserting himself into another dimension. The game never well, explains that. Possible. Nowhere to run now, Toby. I, I get it. My attack isn't what erased that shadow clone. It was Kamui. Damn Kakashi. He figured out that we're connected to the same space. This is it. I can say my original goal of one whole chapter per episode was looking a wee bit optimistic. Anyway, I'll see y'all next time. Yeah, next time's gonna be... Next time's probably just gonna be like a whole bunch of flashbacks. Still very important though, as it explains... It does explain some stuff, but for for Storm Force Story, you really need to have seen the anime or read the manga. Yeah, see y'all next time.